There's 1,200 different, five different shape, two colour glass baubles held onto an armature which is in five sections and they're held on with wire with plastic catheter to protect the glass and we go up with these uh, nylon filament dusters and what we tend to do is go in dry first to try and get as much of the dust off as we possibly can. Not a lot of people like doing it because it is, it is quite high. The chandelier does move, sorry, hanging sculpture, and the machine moves as well. So first morning you're up there, it takes a, a while to get your, your legs back, get your head around it. I think people have missed a sense of the real and the authentic. Uh, huge amounts has happened on digital, which has been very positive, but I think we're all drained by Zoom meetings and Google Hangouts. And we also just want to look at things for ourselves. We don't want to be told what to look at. We want to wander uh, and catch a glimpse of something. So being in galleries, I think, will be really good for the soul. So we will be limiting numbers. It's free, timed, ticketed entry. Um, to begin with, we're just using the ground floor galleries, but that includes South Asia, Japan, China, the Renaissance sculpture uh, galleries. Lots of hand sanitizer. Masks are now mandatory inside the museum once we're open. So there will be a few differences. But the spirit of the V&A, this, this great space for thinking about the most amazing works of material culture produced by the human imagination, that remains. The closure of the museum has, has absolutely hit our, our finances. Uh, the government have supported us this financial year and we're very, very uh, grateful. But with no foreign tourists, uh, with uh, concerns about using the underground still, uh, people not travelling huge amounts in the UK, our numbers are going to be right down. So on the one hand, this is a great time to visit uh, the V&A. But on the other hand, ourselves, like many cultural institutions, are really feeling the hit uh, in terms of our finances. Thank you.